Hello everybody, I'm Raymond McCabe aka Mr. Know-It-All and this is the Commonwealth of Uncommon Knowledge College and today in front of you I want to show you some technology that exists in the firearm industry. If you've caught the other two, um, I enjoy my firearms, my rifles, pistols and shotguns. And these, um, these are examples of military style weapons that were developed to be used in the military. And let's start right here by this one. This is one of the first assault rifles. This gun was made by Hopkins and Allen in 1885 in Connecticut. It's a fine, fine firearm. It lasted all the way up until they decided to go to the semi-automatic version. Now this is a Colt AR-15. The military version is designated M16, which means machine gun. This is a semi-automatic firearm. This one is a very low serial number, very rare. It has the original locking lug for the bayonet. I have several laws that didn't display those. I didn't want to be antagonistic. They have a high rate of fire. This is the magazines. I tape them together so that I can use 30 and 30 to 60 round combination. This one is very small. I use it for, uh, we use these for planking primarily. This one, this one is still capable of being a good hunting rifle. These are, uh, we plank with them. We shoot cans, targets, old car bodies. We enjoy shooting up uh, our ammunition. We reload it and build it. This one is a very fine example. This is a Colt also, and it's the uh, M1A2 version. It also, again, can be adapted with a bayonet. This is uh, built on an Israeli military industries patent called the Galil system. This is uh, the Daewoo 2396. It's a Korean-made. It's a real fine gun. It has a collapsible stock that's rather unique. It falls over like that and it's out of your way. Clip goes in just like all standard 223 caliber. It handles the same magazine clip as does the uh, 223 AR-15. Just like this. There you go. Loaded and ready to go. Enjoy your farms. Use them responsibly. Protect the Second Amendment. Thanks for dropping by. We'll go further on our blogs when we get to hunting and serious gun sports. Thanks for coming in.